Welcome to, This Cruel World. In these videos, we will be going through victims that had unfortunately crossed paths with Jeffrey Dahmer. If you haven't done so already, please consider watching Dahmer's other victims linked at the end of this video. This is Edward Warren Smith and he was Jeffrey Dahmer's seventh victim. Smith, who also goes by Eddie, was a 28-year-old aspiring model when he met Dahmer. On the evening of June 14, 1990, Dahmer and Smith were at the Phoenix Bar in Milwaukee and it was reported that the pair were seen leaving the bar together. During the investigation, Smith's friends told police that they saw the two men together at various clubs in Milwaukee, before the night he went missing, as reported by, the U.S. Sun. Smith's remains were never found and it was through Dahmer's gruesome Polaroids found in the apartment, that the investigator could piece together Smith's murder. After Dahmer's arrest, Smith's sister, Teresa Smith, visited him in prison. First thing when he did when he when he came in is apologize for killing my brother. I asked him why my brother and he said he seen me dance. You know, and um, he liked the way he looked. And he said I was just attracted to him. He, he said he had strangled him. And um, then he was trying some new experiment or something with uh, with uh, preserving the the skull and the body and whatever, and it didn't work. So he had to destroy him. Dahmer confessed to killing Smith that night, however, in this case, he was not able to preserve any of Smith's body parts as he had done with his previous victims. Please like and subscribe to our channel as we will continue to go through each of Jeffrey Dahmer's victims in the upcoming videos.